Okay, so it has been a while since I filmed a video and there is like mascara all over my face, but you know, that's what happens at night time. So <laughs> don't worry about it. Um, yeah, so anyways, I haven't done an update in a really long time, so I thought that I would do a really um, quick one. I wanted to do an update on my um, Clomid and, you know, all of that, and then an update on my weight loss, and I think that's it, yeah. So, um, okay, so first, I want to talk about my weight loss in case um, that's just what you're here for. Um, as y'all know, I told y'all I gained back. Okay, my lowest weight was 144, like after I lost the 60 pounds. And y'all, I got all the way up back up to where I saw a one and a six and a zero. Ah! And I know the little rule on YouTube is usually if somebody disappears, it's because they gained weight. And that's not the case with me. Um, I try to stay accountable when I'm gaining the weight. It just helps me, like, for sure. So, um, yeah, actually, um, of the, well, it's 16 pounds that I gained. So, out of the 16 pounds, I've lost 5 pounds. So, that's really exciting. I'm back down to 155. So, I want to lose, uh, probably just back down to 145, honestly. That's just kind of where I like to stay because I don't like being too small. Um, so yeah, got to lose another 10 pounds. So that is how weight loss is going. And it's, you know, as I've always said, as my channel banner says, um, I did it my way and I just do it by using my fitness pal. I count my calories. Sometimes I don't even have to log my calories. I just know that I'm just eating like smaller portions of things or sometimes I'll eat a lot of little like snacks or meals, whatever you want to call it. Um, and then sometimes I'll just eat like three meals, you know. Um, but yeah, I'm doing really good with that. So I'm excited. My late night eating um, has kind of subsided for the time being. I believe that that's something that just comes and goes. I really do. Um, but I've been going to the gym. Well, I've been once with, <laughs> um, with my best friend. And we did, we go to Planet Fitness. And we just did the circuit, the 30-minute circuit. It's just um, like strength training. And then in between, you step up and down on these boxes. So it's like cardio and strength training. So, yeah, we did that last Monday or Tuesday. Or not last. Like, well, yeah, like last Monday or Tuesday. And, um... So, yeah, that's, other than that, a few days in a row, I did do, um, like, I am back to doing some, like, calisthenics, like, I'm doing push-ups, hey, baby girl, I'm doing, here, you want to say hey to my friend, oh, it's okay, baby, she's very, um, nervous, if you haven't met Foxy yet, but, um, anyway, hi, baby, yeah, but, um, yeah, I've been doing, uh, push-ups, um, like 100 crunches. I'll do 50 to the middle and 25 to each side. So that makes 100. Um, my husband and I have been riding bikes. Um, I just do all sorts of stuff. Just kind of whatever I feel like. I do weights with my arms. So I definitely want to, um, tongue my arms up for sure. And, um, yeah. So that's how the weight loss is going. And, um, let's see. The Clomid. Okay. So as y'all know, we are trying to conceive a baby, a little baby, for um, the first time. And this is, um, I do have polycystic ovarian syndrome, so I'm kind of what you would call infertile. Um, and we know that for various reasons, not just because I was diagnosed with PCOS at 19. Uh, I, just several reasons. But anyways, um, so I started my first round of Clomid. Um... um Sorry, my mind went blank. Um, I started my first round of Clomid this cycle, uh, which was on, I believe, the 28th of January. No, I started my Clomid on, I don't know, it was like the 3rd or something of February. And I took it for five days, so maybe it was the 1st. I don't know. But I took it for five days. It was 50 milligrams. And, yeah. I go in on the 17th to get my progesterone taken, get blood taken to see... Um, if the Clomid did its job and, um, like helped me ovulate and then on, uh, March 1st, I will be able to take a pregnancy test and see if we are preggers. Um, 
I don't want to get my hopes up. Um, I'm actually very like anxious to go to the doctor on the 17th because I don't know. I just I'm just nervous that it's that it didn't like make me ovulate. But that's okay because you know we're only on the first month here, so it's okay. Side effects of the Clomid. I have heard some awful horror stories of the stuff. I haven't had any anything except um, headaches, which I actually have right now. But um. Yeah, I started getting like headaches the day I started taking the Clomid, which I know that's weird, but I did. And they just kind of come and go. They don't like stay forever, so it's not a big deal. And um, yeah, that's the only side effect I've had. And let's see here. Yeah, I think that's all I really wanted to update y'all on. Um, I will make another video when I, you know, have another update of any kind. And yeah, I will talk to y'all soon. Oh, I'm getting my hair cut tomorrow too. So let's see. Comes down to like, it comes down to like the mid of my back. Like, let's see. It's curled, but it comes down to like right here. So yeah, it's just, it's too like long for my taste. Like it, I feel like it's just, just hanging there doing nothing. So I think I want to get a couple inches cut off and then some long layers added in it for when I curl it so it'll be more voluminous. So yeah, okay. I hope y'all have a great night and I'll talk to y'all soon. Love y'all.